Welcome back to AI Plus More, your go-to source for everything AI related and beyond. I am dying to tell you about this new tool called Eleven Labs, a trailblazing AI startup. It has made significant strides in the field of voice technology, offering a suite of cutting edge products and solutions that leverage generative AI models that revolutionize audio content creation. Founded with a commitment to innovation, Eleven Labs has garnered attention for its groundbreaking achievements and has drawn both admiration and scrutiny due to the immense potential and challenges of its technology. At the heart of Eleven Labs' success is Prime Voice AI, an advanced speech software that empowers creators and publishers to generate remarkably authentic audio content. Capable of replicating human intonation, inflections, and contextual adjustments, Prime Voice AI raises the bar for lifelike audio production. From storytelling to audiobooks to realistic newsletter, the platform offers avenues for rich and vibrant narration, enhancing various media formats. Eleven Labs has demonstrated the capability to clone voices from existing audio samples, offering intriguing possibilities for content creators and voice enthusiasts. Before we continue, why don't you like and subscribe? Now let's get on with the video. We're here for our tutorial for Eleven Labs. I've logged out specifically to show you what it looks like when you first get in. We can hear some of the examples here. His eyes narrowed as he spoke. You sure this is the place, Finn? Finn smirked and took a swig from his mug. Trust me, Jareth. This time, I've got it on good authority. The old fisherman from the dock spilled the beans. He leaned back, excitement gleaming in his eyes. It's like the gold is already ours. Let's try out the... Let's listen to the audiobook, see how that sounds. Chapter 1. An Unexpected Party in a hole in the ground, there lived a hobbit. Not a nasty, dirty, wet hole, filled with the ends of worms and an oozy smell, nor yet a dry, bare, sandy hole with nothing in it to sit down on or to eat. It was a hobbit hole, and that means comfort. Okay, you can hear that's hyper-realistic. That's uh, amazing. <laughs> that's uh, kind of breathtaking in a way. Um, you can see... Uh, they've really addressed the concerns about what kind of this uh, this kind of powerful technology is able to do. There's a lot of people that have worried. So we're going to try, uh, I'm going to sign in here. I'm going to try a little bit of voicing with one of the stock voices. And then we'll go on to speech synthesis and the voice lab where you can try out an actual voice that you've made with samples. So let's listen to a few of the samples. If you do what you've always done, you'll get what you've always gotten. A man sees in the world what he carries in his heart. Life isn't about finding yourself. Life is about creating yourself. Sometimes it is better to lose and do the right thing than to win and do the wrong thing. I like a bunch of them. Let's go with Callum. And you can see here that you have voice settings. These are super, super important. If you go get it to default, uh, you'll get the clarity slash similarity enhancement. This is good for when you're doing voice lab and you're not like adding the voice, adding your own samples to replicate a voice. This is useful if background artifacts that are present in the original sample. And this is the stability. This is very important. So when remember when we've generated video, Stability is really important for making sure your generated media is um, stable, as in it gives you a constant output. If you get it to more variable, it gets into the unstable where it'll change tones pretty often and it'll, it might sound a little erratic and it might uh, slow down or might uh, make, or it might get really fast super quick or it might struggle with some words, but that does get a little bit more human though. It depends, it, you should really try it out and more stable, it gets way more robotic, way more uh, AI voice, let's say. And I think the default, it's at 50. We're gonna do around 30%, uh, cause I found that to be a nice sweet spot. 
if you're doing things that are not in English, I recommend 11 Multilingual V1, which is pretty good for other languages. We're gonna do English here, of course, but we're gonna try out an example. I think that's good. So, so if you leave a period at the end, it'll sound like the phrase is ending, and if you don't, it won't. Uh, it'll sound uh, narrate all sorts of videos. Like, it, like it'll sound, it'll sound as if the phrase is not over. So let's generate that. Hello, this is a voice I am trying out. I might be an AI voice, but I'm doing my best. I can list different things, be in different moods, and narrate all sorts of videos. I'm gonna say it. Uh, that's scary good. That's that's so so good. You can um, rate it here, so the algorithm improves. You can download it, and I think you can download up to 5,000 characters with this version that I have. The plan that I've gotten is for 40,000 characters. And we're gonna talk a little bit about pricing in just a bit, but let's try a voice that we are creating. So I recorded a little bit of this Tarantino interview just because it's a very particular voice. I thought that the AI could have a fun time. We're going to listen to a little bit about uh, what the interview is about. I think it's about the Django movie. Um, God, it's, I've always wanted to explore slavery in, in a film before. I think it's a pretty clear recording that we could use. So I'm going to download it. Use this Chrome extension called... Um, sample which is pretty useful and we're gonna plug it in here we're gonna go to voice lab and add a generated or cloned voice there's voice design where you can design entirely new voices by adjusting the parameters every voice you create is randomly generated and it's entirely unique even if the same settings are applied there's a voice library to add a voice from the community. You can see there's a professional voice cloning to create a perfect digital replica of the voice. We're gonna do instant voice cloning. We're gonna type in Tarantino and it says here to upload files and same, saying sample quality is more important than quantity. Noisy samples may give bad results. Provide more than five minutes of audio in total brings in little improvements. So we're gonna add, I think it's around 30 seconds. So we see here that our sample is 10 megabytes, so I'm gonna shorten it a little bit. It asks you for a description, which is uh, pretty useful, and it takes no time to use. Let's go ahead and do that. Um, we'll do 11 English. We'll do less stable, so we get a uh, pretty um, expressive, let's say. I think those are, um, I think it's good to use uh, proper nouns to try out how it works. Sometimes it struggles with those. Let's generate that and see how it sounds. I have a lot of ideas to communicate. If you just give me the time, I can tell you all about them. I promise I won't disappoint. Zoom is a software, Eleven Labs is a website, AI Plus More is a YouTube channel. That's um, <laughs> that's so accurate, and that's uh, not even. Uh, I didn't play that much with them. We can try out more unstable and see how that uh, works. I have a lot of ideas to communicate. If you just give me the time, I can tell you all about them. I got. I promise I won't disappoint. Zoom is a software. Um, Eleven Labs is a website. AI plus. More is a YouTube channel. You should eat an apple a day to keep the doctor away. Okay, uh, you saw that it even gave you an um in the middle. I think it said 11 Labs is a website, um. That's uh, scary good. That is so accurate. And uh, that's the more unstable version. You can see that it, um, it'll get faster, it'll get slower, it'll doubt itself. Uh, or it'll simulate doubt, let's say. And if I give you the most stable version, it's gonna get a little bit robo robotic. So let's try a different thing, a different text, and try it out. Again, this is gonna be in the sta more stable version, and we're not really touching the clarity part. Uh, I found it this to be the sweet spot. Uh, you can test it out in, in other directions. It might get too 
way too many artifacts, like a little bit um, on the harsh side if you get it too high. Written in 1787, ratified in 1788, and in operation since 1789, the United States Constitution is the world's longest surviving written charter of government. It definitely sounds a little bit more natural, but it won't sound as natural as the more unstable one. So I recommend playing around with this. Uh, this is uh, red as in the danger zone, but I find it to be a lot more human. Let's, since we only heard this one with the more stable, let's listen to this just for a second. And remember, you can download all of these uh, when they're done generating. Written in 1787, ratified in 1788, and in operation since 1789, the United States Constitution is the world's longest surviving written charter of government. Its first three words, we the people, uh, affirm that the government of the U United States exists to serve its citizens. I, I don't know how it did that, those two little uh, pauses that it did. Um, one that it took a breath in the middle of a word, and also one that said um, a double vowel at the beginning of a word, like uh-uh. That's eerie. That's very, th that's amazing. This is one of the most powerful tools that we've tested out. You can see that they have a huge variety of voices, and we'll, we can listen to a bit of it. There is no failure except in no longer trying. Um, maybe this one. Uh, a lot of them were added by people. Good actions give strength to ourselves and inspire good actions in others. The truth of the matter is that you always know the right thing to do. The hard part is doing it. Those are all pretty outstanding. We're going to go into the plans. So you can see here, these are all the plans that they have available. The free version doesn't allow you for creating your own voice. That's important to know. You get up to 10,000 characters per month. You get up to three custom voices. You get uh, random voices using voice design. Uh, you can create speech in English, German, Polish, Spanish, Italian, French, Portuguese, and Hindi. That's super useful. You don't get a commercial license, though. That's important to know. And that's the free version. Then you get the starter version. It's at $5, but you get 80% off in the first month. That's a great deal. For only $1, you get 30,000 characters per month. You can create up to 10 custom voices. Uh, commercial license included, and you get instant access to voice cloning, which is the tool that we've been using. There's also the creator. At $22 a month, you get 100,000 characters. You get high quality 96 uh, kilobytes per second audio outputs. And then the additional use, you get, you get 30 cents per thousand characters. Then the independent publisher, you get half a million characters. That's I think that's like four audiobooks. So I think you're gonna be pretty good. I think that's, that's about um, 15 hours of audio. So yeah, that's only for $99 a month uh, for your independent authors and publishers that want to engage their audience using audio. And then the growing business uh, for growing publishers and companies with higher discounts and quotas. Uh, $330 a month, you get 660 custom voices, 2 million characters, around 40 hours of generating audio. And you get each plan with a lower price per thousand characters after that. And then there's an enterprise, which is a custom plan uh, for big companies that want to uh, something more tailored for them. As Eleven Labs continues to refine its technology, the possibilities for voice AI remain tantalizingly expansive. From audiobooks to language learning apps, interactive games, and more, voice AI holds the potential to redefine human-computer interaction and unlock immersive experiences. By nurturing a community of innovators and leveraging the power of AI, Eleven Labs is shaping the future of audio content creation and human expression. And that's been the comprehensive review from here, AI Plus More. I hope you enjoy 11 Labs and give it a good use. Make sure to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you know about future videos. 
and check out these other videos that you might enjoy. Here, AI Plus More, stay creative.